Hello, welcome to another DX Camerata toy review. This time we have the DX Para DX Paradax Camerata's <laughs> uh, Henshin Gashat, and of course he has uh, the fighter there and the puzzle form, um, perfect puzzle and uh, something fighter. Forgot the name of that. So this is a double-sided Gashat, similar in size to the. Um, Mighty Brothers Double X Gasha, but of course it has this extra wheel on there. There's also going to be another version of these in orange that has a shooting simulation, another one for Kamarada Bra uh, Kamarada Brave and um yeah, it's Brave Crap. <laughs> and uh Brave and I forgot the name of the shooting one. Oh well. Uh, but there you go. Uh, <laughs> so they're gonna get their own versions, their own version as well with a different wheel. So two more games in that. Flap is got on the front this time again, and uh, on the back there you got uh, some images showing you, hey, what you get inside. Uh, you can use this on some of the different toys as well as this big weapon there. The weapon that is a let's see, yeah, the weapon by uh, Mighty Brothers Double, Mighty Double Brothers X weapon form form weapon of course the camperizing machine and there's another image of the two the riders two forms at the top there and um yeah the uh, sh3 guys for that uh, suit would be pretty nice um we also have some of the uh, the uh, play functions listed there opening the box up it's uh, in the standard sort of dx toy cardboard box setup so you gotta trade out the toys in the little baggies i've already opened the baggies up uh this toy requires two AAA batteries to function just like the Mighty Brothers Double X get shot. And here's a quick look at the instruction sheet that's uh, set of tape to this uh, cardboard box that I haven't removed the tape, so I'm just gonna oh, hold this. Uh, hold this up in front of the camera. Here's a quick look at the instruction manual we move from that cardboard backing. And here's the back, again showcasing all the different ways you can play with this. So inside the box you get two items, you got his um, like DX thing holder, because he doesn't use a belt to henshin, he henshins directly with this gasha. So once he's henshin, he, he's, he has a belt when he's become the rider, and he just sticks the gasha in here when he's not holding or using it. Because this is a double sided gasha which will fit uh, Mighty Brothers double X gasha, so I'm going to turn that on. And um, and guys, you can stick that in if you want. But that happened. Uh, so this this is the maximum drive slot <laughs> for XA. So so that happened. Um. Yeah, so, yeah, we have, of course, the main gas shot here. Uh, we got, oop, perfect puzzle on one side. And actually, this stands pretty well, so that's good. I don't need to hold it. Uh, perfect puzzle. It's got some weird buggy thing on top there. And, of course, a bubble bubble type font and coloring. And you see speaker holes on this side. Uh, on the other side, we have a knockout fighter. Of course, uh, looking kind of like, I guess, a bit between Street Fighter and King of Fighters, kind of, maybe. And, uh... This is where the battery goes in actually, there's a little tab there and you slide this sideways and you can put the uh, batteries inside, two AAAs. Uh, two buttons here, like like the uh, regular gas shots going on, so this is for obviously functioning in the, uh, the gamer driver. We have an image inside on um, both of these, both, both sides of these. Um, with because of plus, transparent plastic to show the light, shine the light through. Uh, QR code's on top of this, which is kind of sucks because it's like on top, so it's really obvious. Oh well. On well, course, on top of here we have this giant flower thingy, or Beyblade thingy, uh, that has the two um, images depending which side you use. The top one of course, is the one that's active, and because you've got the middle place here. Uh, but sticking this in the game driver will not matter which side you put, you turn it, it does a little remix of both as one. So, uh, let's turn this on. Oh, by the way, yeah, the coloring has got shiny metallic blue, just like all Gashat, it's got a little bit of shine to it. And blue on both sides. Let's do that again. Like I said, the henshin's without the need of that, so a lot of the sounds already come from this, on, uh, like on its own, before sticking in anything. Game start. 
You see both these buttons go down together, so it is the same button. Uh, there's a gimmicky handlebar here, but uh, I don't think anyone's gonna actually hold it like this, so that's a bit silly. You just, it's just there to fit with the same motif of the other gashats, uh, but not really. Uh, be the same as it, and just for size comparison, you can see it's actually way bigger than the other gashats, so yeah. Hmm, funny thing that I used the zombie gashat to compare to. Uh, Yeah, I don't think there's any hidden sounds, there's no loose sound or anything. So let's do a uh, perfect puzzle first, because that's what he does in the show. So let's flip this upwards. Perfect puzzle. Saying, what's the next stage? I don't know where you can see that, but um, yeah, you got perfect puzzle image in there. Uh, puzzles printed pattern on the background for the writer to stand there. And uh, I don't know if you noticed, but the image inside is actually pretty bad. Uh, it's quite ugly. Um, so let's stick this in here now that it's. This is Jewel Gasha. Do it again. So yeah, and if you push this button now, Game start. just does that again. So can I do anything like this? If you twist it now when it's still inside, yeah, nothing. Uh, so yeah, perfect combo, uh, critical strike, something. Uh, so now let's move on to the fighter side. So just twist, twist. So yeah, it lights up one side, and the image again is, uh, the, yeah, the print quality is very low on these images. I don't know what's wrong, it's not even stickers or anything, it's really bad. Um, it's not even like a light image or anything, like Mighty uh, Brothers Double X. It's a very poorly printed image, so that sucks. So I'm going to stick this in here. And of course, no matter, you can't stick this on the other side, just doesn't want to fit in there. So, meaning that the fighter sticker side is not going to be seen for the most part because uh, even if you put it in the gamer driver, it's going to show this side, so it's going to be more puzzle stuff. Uh, let's do the final attack for him then. So, uh, <laughs> there you go, um, yeah, not, not really too much going on there. Uh, let's stick this in the, <clears throat> let's stick this in the gamer driver. So see, he's now doing uh, both fighter and puzzle. And now the image is even upside down, which, um... Yeah, that's not very cool. I, I don't know. Like, it just looks weird being upside down. Well, the image does look a little bit better because it's being reflected through a mirror, so it's a bit blurrier. So close it. 
Open it again. So, yeah, there you go. Again, mix of both final tech sounds together, and you get that. So, you do this again. So I'm gonna see if I can get the weapon sound then by pushing all three buttons down at the same time. Uh, let's see if I can do that. So how then it looks. Let's see, let's try it again. Okay, there you go. Uh, and I'm gonna assume that uh, the weapon does the remaining attack sounds. So there you go. Uh, this is an oddity. I mean, it it's very bulky, and let's be honest, it's quite ugly. It's got it's like it's got a tumor sticking out of the side of a gasha. And uh, mighty brothers double mighty brothers. Mighty Double Brothers, uh, Mighty Brothers Double X is uh, very cool looking, uh, very cool colors as well. Uh, whereas this one looks very standard and its functionality is somewhat limited. And the stickers aren't good looking inside, the image is blurry and very cheap print. Um, so, yeah. Uh, it's hard to recommend this. I mean, the sounds and tunes are okay in puzzle and fighting are. Um, Pretty special combination for a Gashat. I mean, yeah, we do have puzzle fighters like Street Fighter and then Mortal Kombat copy that, so that there's some logic to this Gashat. But unless you really like the tunes here, um, I'd say skip this one. It, it's not that good um, as a toy. Uh, it's not too many playability or functionality as well as um, the whole gimmick of combining this with other Gashats is not there. If you are going to pick up like a thicker special Gasha, go with Mighty Brothers Double X because it's much prettier. It's much nicer looking. It makes more sense in terms of shape and color. And the image gimmick inside is much nicer than the one in here. In fact, it would have been nice if this one followed the same route where the image is on the same side and then we use some mirror trick to do some sort of combination. Like, uh, imagine if they followed this and they had one image for fighter, one image for puzzle, and when you put it in the game driver, it becomes two image becomes one and you have like a special one. That would have been way nicer. Instead, we have crappy stickers on both sides that just light up one after the other. So, yeah, not recommended uh, unless you have to collect all the gashats or you just really, really like the sounds here. If you're just playing with some uh, X8DX stuff, you're not too bothered with all the gashats, then this is an easy easy pass.